send help. Doug about to cause diplomatic incident. They stayed next door last night, you know, checking the place out. They should really sell tickets when they buy in. <laughs> oh, it's nice to see you smile again. Hasn't been much fun round here, has it? Don't be daft. How's Aaron doing? Another victim's come forward. Really? When? Yesterday. The police won't tell him much. I'm just glad whoever it is had the guts. Can't have been easy. Yeah. Maybe they saw what you did to Gordon's car. Hmm. Wasn't such a bad idea after all. <laughs> Don't mind me. Maybe you should make a start. Yeah, sure. Mm. Love. Mum, I'm sick of talking about it. I know. I just want you to promise me to stop feeling guilty about this other victim. Because if anybody should be doing that, it should be Gordon. You need to leave. Right now. You know why I'm here. You have no right. How many more were there, huh? It's all lies. Don't you dare come in here denying what you've done. The sooner you are rotting in prison, the better. Okay. Oh. Bad idea. Doing this will only make things worse. Well, you should be happy then, since you're determined to ruin my life. Oh, you did that all by yourself. You know, people look at me like I'm dirt. They've got that right then, haven't they? There was no one else. No one. How much are you paying him? What are you on about? Ryan! Who? You know damn well the kid who lives down the road from me. I barely even spoke to him, only suddenly he's decided I've done far worse than that. So I'll ask you again. How much are you paying him? Oh, no, I, I don't know anything about that. All I care about is that. Stop lying! <laughs> you better call him off, or I'm really gonna get nasty. <laughs> What's his number? Call him. Tell him to pull a statement. I don't even know who he is. Are you okay? What's he doing here? He was threatening me. And why would I do that? She's lying. Get out! I only wanted to talk. You heard her. You're making a big mistake. You can't be yeah. allowing money in if he's not prepared to change anything. It's difficult for him. And we'll never get anywhere if you keep picking fault. Have a nice night away. I have never met anyone so stuck in their ways. <laughs> Right, I'll see you later. All right, said it was going. Not quick enough. Gordon, are you all right? When did he turn up? Get off me. Chance, what's happened? Does he hurt you? Of course not. That's what I'm asking you. I haven't touched that. Right, call the police. I'll do it. Come on. On their way. Thanks, love. Why don't we go through to the back, yeah, and I'll meet you with Brew. I'm going nowhere till the police arrive. So you can make up more lies. Don't give him the satisfaction. Don't tell me you believe all this. After the hours we spent talking, everything I said to you was the truth. I'm proud of my son. Don't call him that. All I wanted to do was sit down and talk. Get him some more counselling, perhaps. You know, the longer you let him carry on with these false memories or whatever they are, the harder it's going to be for him to get over it. I swear, if you don't shut up. We need to help him through this. You're either insane or stupid. I wish I'd never met you in that flaming hospital and brought you back into Chaz and Aaron's lives. Because I hate myself for it. 